Welcome to the game theory. Today we are going to solve a mixed game using the principle of dominance. Here we have a 3 by 4 payoff matrix of player A and player B. Now the principle of dominance is based on the phenomenon that in a mixed game certain columns dominate over other columns and certain rows dominate over other rows. Remember, the idea is to minimize the losses of player B and maximize the gains of player A. Now, let's begin by finding the dominant column of player B. Now, when we consider column 2 and 3, we find that the elements of column 3 are greater than the column 2. Therefore, we cancel out column 3. Why? Because the idea is to minimize the losses of player B. Now let's compare the second and the fourth column. So we find that the elements of the fourth column are greater than the second column. So we cancel out the fourth column. So player B is left with column 1 and column 2. Now let's go to player A. And let's compare the rows. We find that third row elements, except the last one, are greater than the first row elements. Here we cancel out the first row because the idea is to maximize the gain of player A. Now we are left with columns 1 and 2 of player B and rows 2 and 3 of player A. The next step is to find the augments. To find augment 2, you need to subtract the elements of the third row. So that would be 6 minus 3, which is equal to 3. And augment 3 would be 4 minus 3, that is equal to 1. To find the augment 1 of player B, we need to subtract the elements of the second column. That is 4 minus 3, which is equal to 1. And to find augment 2 of player B, subtract the elements of the first column. That will be 6 minus 3, which is equal to 3. Let's uh, total up the augments. This would be 4 and this is also equal to 4. Now to find the probability P1, the uh, formula is augment by total augment. So here it would be 3 divided by 4, which is the total augment. And P2 is 1 divided by 4. So we do the same for player B. So Q1 would be 1 divided by the total augment, which is 4. And Q2 is 3 divided by 4. To find the value of the game, you need to multiply the augments into the first column element. So that would be... 3, okay, the, the, these are the arguments. So 3 into 3 plus 1 into 6 whole divided by the total argument, which is 4. So that will be 9 plus 6 by 4, which is equal to 15 by 4. So the value of the game is 15 by 4. Now here's our solution. The optimal strategies of player A are 3 by 4, comma 1 by 4, comma 0 and 0. And the optimal strategies of player B are 1 by 4, comma, yeah, 3 by 4, comma, 0 and 0. 
and the value of the game is 15 by 4 and since the value of the game is positive the game is favorable to player A. To summarize we have solved a 3 by 4 payoff matrix with no saddle point using the principle of dominance. Here we have eliminated the dominating columns of player B and the dominating row of player A. So we have to remember the idea is to minimize the losses of player B and maximize the gains of player A. And then we have reduced the matrix to a 2x2 two two matrix and we have found the admin by subtracting the elements of the opposite rows and the opposite columns. And using the oddments, we have found the probability and the formula is oddment divided by total oddment. We have found the value of the game by multiplying the oddments into the first column elements and adding them up and dividing the whole by the total oddment. And when the value of V is positive, the game is said to be favorable to player A. Hope you found this video helpful. Thank you and happy learning.